Spectroscopy is the study of how light interacts with matter. We take a sample and we shine some form of light on it and we look at how that light is either absorbed or emitted from the sample. We can use that application for a variety of different disciplines, ranging from chemistry to biology, forensics, material science, physics, astronomy, the list can really go on and on. If you're a forensic scientist and you come across an unknown powder or unknown solution at a crime scene, so you need to know the exact confirmation of the identity, so you can use spectroscopy to be able to identify explicitly what that material may be. Students oftentimes will come to smaller schools like Waynesburg because they get much more hands-on experience with a lot of the different types of instrumentation that we have available. One of the labs that we have them do is work on an atomic absorption spectrophotometer. And what that is, it's a giant flame that allows you to evaporate your samples and look for things like gunshot residue. So they're able to go through and identify whether or not different swabs from people's hands have actually had gunshot residue on them. Many of our students have gone on to work at materials companies, pharmaceutical companies, local and state crime laboratories as forensic majors. And with all of those, the starting salaries vary, but typically with a bachelor's level degree in chemistry, you can expect to earn approximately forty dollars to $50,000 as a starting salary. If you have the type of mind where you really like puzzles and, and strategy, spectroscopy really comes into play. 